Hey, Nerdlings! What up, Nerdlings? It is YouTuber of the Year. Hosting edition! That is right, nerdlings. The end of 2019 is upon us. A whole new decade is right around the corner, which means it is time for us to pass these hosting duties off to somebody else. First and foremost, what is YouTuber of the Month? YouTuber of the Month is a community-driven tradition that started back in 2011, and it is a way to help some smaller channels get a little bit extra exposure. So what happens is, you take a winner, they pick five nominees, you guys get to choose on who you want to be the next winner of YouTuber of the Month. And that cycle continues. The idea is for everyone to get a little extra exposure while you are checking out some awesome new channels. And boy have we discovered quite we a few. We have. One last time, just so you know, the rules are very simple. Under 3,000 subs, a good on-screen presence, and gaming related. That's all it is. Quite simple. This time is going to be a little more different though because to choose your new host we are going to revisit all of the winners from 2019. But first I want to say thank you all of you for embracing us as the hosts for YouTuber of the Month in 2019. First of all, Russ Lyman, who hosted last year. Amazing job. That was a hard act yes, to follow. It really, really was. But him, and especially all of you, have come together as an awesome community to help make this work for another full year. And we cannot thank you enough for always coming in, voting, helping these channels, getting some new nominees, checking out some more channels and keeping that going. We want to thank you so much from the bottom of our heart. You made us feel very, very welcome. We had huge shoes to fill and you made it very, very easy for us to step into those and just smooth right on into a good year of videos and channels and making new friends. And we just had a blast and we're very sad to see it go, but we know the next host is going to do an even better job than we did. So before we turn it over to them, I'm going to put you on the spot. What was one of your favorite moments hosting YouTuber of the Month this year? Honestly, it would probably have to be when Sega had smashed that egg on his head. <laughs> that cracked me up. That was a little unexpected. Did not expect that, especially when he just said, Hey guys, get an egg and I'll take it from there. <laughs> take four! I will say, though, I do have an honorable mention. Oh? Yes, I actually had a lot of fun chopping Robert's head off. Well, oh, you actually chopped it off, but uh, it was funny to watch. Holy shit. What about you? What was your favorite? So, I don't necessarily have a favorite moment, but I really liked how much the winners would work with us in doing things like the text messages via the Power Glove. A Power Glove text message from do you nod or the uh, morse code via rob you be quiet you're a collectible or even just the controller finding who's worthy to be the next winner ow what the hedgehog well enough of us blubbering about ourselves this is all about your winners so let's turn it over to them and guys pay very close attention and listen and find out who wants you to vote for them and who maybe doesn't want you to vote. Hello everybody, it's me, Frank the Gamer. So, do you nerd ask the game beaters to submit a video because they are nominated to host the YouTuber of the Month videos in the year 2020. So, the game beaters asked me to do this introduction because they have a master plan to get you to vote for them down in the comments. Let's check in with them now and see what those weirdos are up to. Guys? Vote for the game beaters. You want to vote for the game beaters. You want to vote for the game beaters. Right, Frank? Tell them. Oh, Whitey. So, uh, vote for the game beaters. Well, you know what? Screw those guys and vote for me. Frank the Gamer. Okay, love you. Bye-bye. Bye. 
Mile High Game Hunters here. We are one of the winners of YouTuber of the Month, and you probably shouldn't vote for us to be the host of YouTuber of the Month. Uh, we haven't uploaded a video in goddamn a year, probably. Um, so we would be hosts of YouTuber of next year. That would probably be the better title. Uh, please don't vote for us, but we appreciate that you did vote for us. Just, just don't do it again. Don't. Love you. Hi, do you nerd? This is Bill here. You know I'm Bill. Um, I just want to say a big thank you to you two. A, a sincere thank you. Um, for all the hard work you did on the YouTuber of the month. You did a fantastic job. Very warm, nice hosts. I just also want to say a big thanks to all the, um, the other content creators as well that were shown on there. Not just the ones that won. Um, but also the ones that, that also had fantastic content that um, I'm now proud to say I'm subscribed to. To all of you, keep up the good work and a big thank you to everyone that actually voted for me as well. It was very uh, nice and surprising to win YouTuber of the Month. Yeah, so keep up the good work. So I'm trying to follow a path here while walking through mud while Wilson's dragging me through it. So multitasking mentally. And in, in regards to like uh, me being the host, I think I would do, I'm being honest here, I think I'd do a terrible job because uh, my mind's all over the place with uh, house decorating, getting my own content out. And if I add schedules and stuff to my own existing channel, I would be like, what the hell? How am I going to get this done? So I think I'd do a terrible job. Not, not in the way that you've done it. You've done it great. So I'll leave it there. Thanks for everything, and I'll see you once again for more late night reviews. Bye bye, everyone. Bye bye. Shut up! Ladies and gentlemen, let me give you the reason why you should not vote for me. You see, I have always enjoyed the luxury of knowing that if YouTube ever becomes too stressful for me, too shitty for me, or just stops being fun to do, then I can always just quit. You know, this isn't a job, it's a hobby, so if it ever becomes pointless as a hobby, I can always jack it in. But to be the host for YouTuber of the Month means that for a whole year, I have to dedicate myself to that. And the funny thing is, that looking forward a year and having to plan all of that stresses me out a bit. Makes me think about quitting. That's not the sole reason why I would quit, it's just an example. So it's more likely for me to be here in a year's time on YouTube if I didn't host YouTuber of the Month. In other words, I'm not good enough for the job. Tom and Lacey have done a fantastic job of it, and I know that I would fuck it up. In other words, vote for someone else. Thank you very much, and ta -ra! Hello, the unit, and hello, everyone. I just wanted to say thank you. I'm very humbled and thankful for being a winner in 2019 for YouTuber of the Month. Uh, unfortunately, I will not be participating for host, but I would like to say go vote for Sega Head because I know he will love and nail it being a host for 2020. Thank you, everyone. Well, hey there, Tom and Lacey. Thanks so much for having me on the Do You Nerd channel. Um, why would I want to be YouTuber of the year and take on the torch from you guys? Because you've been doing it so freaking awesome this year, controlling the whole YouTuber of the month thing. Um, YouTuber of the month is something I rolled into by accident. Somebody tagged me in there, uh, nominated me, and immediately I got thrown into the really cool retro gaming community. Uh, it's something I've been following. I, I follow it every month. I, I check out every channel that gets nominated, and usually I, I find a couple of really cool YouTubers in there, which I've connected with, which have become my best YouTube buddies. If there's any way you guys think I, sh I could be up for the challenge of doing the YouTuber of the Month thing next year, um, vote for me for YouTuber of the Year, and I will gladly take over the torch and try to do my best. And I'm sure the next guy that gets nominated for YouTuber of the Year will take good care of it, because it's such an awesome initiative. Thanks so much, guys. See ya. And yeah, Tom, let's play some Friday the 13th, eh? What's up, y'all? Retro Rick here, and one reason why you should vote for me to host YouTuber of the Month next year, and that reason is because I own a freaking Turbo Man doll. It's That's right, the coveted superhero action figure that Arnie was after in Jingle All The Way. And I guarantee you that none of the other Jabroni nominees have a Turbo Man. And my question is, can you really trust another human being that doesn't own a Turbo Man? No. The answer is that you cannot. 
Thank you for your consideration, and don't you ever freaking forget. You can always count on me. Hey everybody, it's uh, Mr. August over here, former YouTuber of the Month, some would argue YouTuber of the Year, Critical Fabulous. I, uh, I can't tell you how much my life has changed since I was named YouTuber of the Month. People stop me in the streets, uh, they shower me with gifts, somebody gifted me this cough. <coughs> <coughs> um, I get a lot of perks, like on this bowl of noodles for normal people, 99 cents, me, two for a dollar. So life is good, so it would be a total honor if I could be the, the bastion of this great tradition and, and bestow all the the accolades that it brings to the next round of uh, participants. And uh, yeah, I guess above all, it would be nice to have a reason to get up in the morning again. I uh, I kind of miss what that feeling is like. So uh, yeah, vote for me. Hello. This is an urgent appeal. Thousands and thousands of young children are dying to see the button bashers win YouTuber of the Year. If you want to see Comedy Gold hosted by the dynamic duo, the gruesome twosome, pledge your vote in the comments below. Thank you. Please, comment down below. Bashers for the win. Thank you. Oh, hey, Tom and Lacey. It's so nice of you to stop by. And since you did, let's talk about YouTuber of the Year. Why do we want YouTuber of the Year? Well, let's answer your question with a question. Does a bear shit in the woods? Because we already know that Tom does. We also know that Tom likes to play little jokes, which result in people getting their freaking heads cut off. So, with that being said, we need to win YouTuber of the year so we can dethrone the irresponsible, murderous, do you nerd, as the 2019 hosts of YouTuber of the Month. So, officially consider our hats in the ring. But, in all seriousness, we would love to be YouTubers of the year and host YouTuber of the Month. The example that Russ Lyman and Do You Nerd set, the high quality, it's inspirational to the whole community and we would love to take on the tradition and set the bar for YouTuber of the Month. It would be fantastic. So, vote for us! Hi everyone, this is the Retro Bear speaking to you live from the Gaming Pantry. Well, live as recorded. Uh, just want to say once again a massive, massive thank you to Tom and Lacey over at Do You Nerd for the wonderful job they've done this year with the YouTuber of the Year competition. And once again, uh, it was a great honour to be nominated and also to win in my designated month, which I can't remember because it was only a few weeks ago. But anyway... Um, it's just a quick video to say uh, I won't be putting myself forward for um, nomination for this year's overall winner. Um, it's just not the right time for me at the moment. But what I'd look like to say to everybody out there who is going to go forward, wishing you all the very best of luck. May the best YouTuber win. And I do hope that I will see everybody again at some point during 2020 in the gaming pantry. But from the UK, uh, best of luck to everybody else and bye for now. Greetings, Earthlings, and viewers of the YouTube. I am Sagabot, and before Master Zombie comes into the room, I just wanted to quickly say, please vote for Sega Zombie to host YouTuber of the Month for 2020. Oh, here he comes now. What's going on here, then, I, Sagabot? I, I just spoke to the viewers of YouTube. Ah, oh, right, okay, so you started the video without me. Greetings, YouTube. Sega Zombie here, and as Sega's bot has already started this video, this is just a really quick campaign video just to say thank you, everyone that voted for me for the month of December, and also please vote for me again to be the host of YouTuber of the month. Come on, let's bring this back to the UK. Well, nerdlings, there you have it. Your 12 winners 
of 2019. Regardless of if they want you to vote for them or not, there will be links for all of those channels in the description below. Please check them out, enjoy their stuff, make sure you're caught up on their stuff, they're always putting new things out, and figure out who you think deserves to be the host for YouTuber of the Month 2020. And come back here and leave a comment down below. I vote for whoever to be your new host of YouTuber of the Month for 2020. Voting will end December 31st, midnight Central Standard Time. Nerdlings, if you happen to like the video, please give it a like. Don't forget to comment with your vote on who you want as the new host. Be sure to share this video because we're going to need a new host. <laughs> Don't forget to like us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram so that you know when the new host has been revealed. And go over to TeePublic because we've got merchandise over there. And if we like it, we nerd it. And vote for it.